Hello, my name is Armie Agbekin, and I'm an intern with the Data Warehouse. Today I'm going to talk about report books and data dictionary. All of these will be located on our very useful resources page. If you don't know how to access it, this link will be provided at the bottom of the YouTube video, and you can also access it by Googling DODG Warehouse, clicking on the first link, and pressing Getting Started. The resources are on the left side. So the data dictionaries and the report books are big folders with many subfolders. The data dictionary itself contains a PDF file explaining every single report available in the data warehouse. It shows its subfolders and its description. This is very useful when you don't exactly know what you need. You can read through this and pick out uh, which report you need. The report books are a more detailed form of the data dictionary. There is a report book for every, almost every single report available in the data warehouse. It shows you the data it contains and how to access it. For example, let's look at the Employment First report. Many of us use this report on a daily basis. It's a PDF file that you can download, and it has, when you open it in Query Studio, it shows what is launched and what options you have to ch uh, check and what the default settings are. If you don't uh, put a detail in, it will automatically go to the default. And then it shows you an example of what one of these reports will look like and what categories will be available. So you can take a look at that. We've taken out all identifying information, but if you uh, want to make a report and look at these categories, it'll help you decide which one to use. And we have these for all the different options available of the Employment First and every other data warehouse report that we have. So like I said, these are located in the resources page of the Data Warehouse web page. If you have any other questions, please feel free to contact us. This is the email addresses of all the Data Warehouse team, um, team members, and we're always here to help. Thank you.